William and Princess Kate choose children over the monarchy in a contentious decision. It has been stated that the Prince and Princess of Wales, in their future planning, have determined that their three children will always come before duty. Despite growing demands to become more involved in the monarchy, the Prince and Princess of Wales have chosen that their three children come first. This information follows reports in the media that the couple has turned their backs on Australia, causing some to believe that Australia has been forgotten while the royal family embarks on a two-year tour of the Commonwealth. The pair has made it clear that their children would always come first, given that they are so young, despite rumors that King Charles has even put pressure on them to perform more royal tasks. Insider said, William and Kate have been put in a very difficult position of choosing between the right path for their family or the future of the monarchy. Although they value both equally, they have chosen to prioritize their young children over themselves. Three children total, Prince George, 10, Princess Charlotte, 8, and 5-year-old Prince Louis, are born to the couple. Second in line for the throne, George is a student at Lambert School right now. When he turns 13, he is supposed to go to Eton College. The insider said in an interview with Oak that Kate is adamant that she doesn't want to uproot the children during the school year. She believes that having their parents around and keeping them grounded is crucial. Kate will stay at home when Prince William visits Singapore the following month to accept the 2023 Earthshot Prize. It was just confirmed. Following rumors that she might accompany William, as she has in the past, Buckingham Palace verified this information. It was further stated by sources that the mother of three would stay in Windsor alongside George, Charlotte, and Louis. The insider continued, discussing the couple's recent decision. Kate's childhood was rather chaotic with several moves to the Middle East and around England, and so was William's when he toured with his parents or was sent away to boarding school. Until their kids are mature enough to handle it, neither of them wants that for them, they continued. William attended the September 19 Earthshot Prize Innovation Summit in New York City, but Kate was noticeably missing from that trip as well. The couple's move differs greatly from that of other royals who prioritize duty. Not even a year old at the time, the late queen famously left Charles at home with her parents when she went to Malta in 1949. 